all over the ice and uh, um, get on the puck as much as I can. And um, just tonight was one of those games where I mean, when I passed, they seemed to score, so it was, it was nice. It's like a second season for you. I mean, you guys lose in the ECAC, and then you come in here and, and you're in the middle of a playoff race. Does it kind of feel like, you know, two seasons in one? Yeah, definitely. I mean, uh, I think that was my 10th game tonight, so that was uh, that was like a third of my college season. So um, <laughs> it's kind of funny to think about it that way. But, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a different schedule. Obviously, you play more games here, but uh, I think uh, I like it a lot better. And, um, I think I'm getting adjusted, uh, getting used to it now, so it's good. It's a mentality right now just to try to have – Every game means something. I mean, you know, you obviously you need an awful lot of help, but you can't you can't control that. So it's just nice to go into like Friday night's game and you take the ice, you'll still be alive. So yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, you obviously uh, want to be playing for something. Um, it's never fun being uh, mathematically eliminated because uh, you kind of just are counting down the days after that. But um, I mean, yeah, every um, game we can uh, get closer and. Um, I think it's good coming to the rink. It keeps the guys focused and um, stuff like that. So uh, it's definitely good. We stayed alive tonight and um, try and keep it going on the weekend. With that first goal in the third period uh, to take the lead, can you guys feel the momentum swinging your way there? Yeah, I think uh, I think we came out in the third. We had a good first and, and second shift. And then uh, once we got that goal, I think uh, it kind of relaxed our bench a bit. And then uh, after that, I think the boys kind of settled in and we started to play more of our game. and. Um, we were fortunate to get uh, a few more there. You feeling pretty comfortable in the